Okay, we've talked about the six count Charleston tuck turn. We're gonna tack on a four count U move to that and end up making a 10 count move. So before we try to put them together, let's review the four count U move. In the tuck turn, we switched hands. So we're now in a cross hand move. And the U move starts with a rock step, rock step, plant, rock. Okay, so I actually did five moves just to get into the next one. It goes one, two, three, four right back in. So leader is one of the things I'm focusing on is to keep my hand nice and low. Okay, I don't want to confuse her and think that we're doing this into a tuck turn like we're getting out of it. We want to come here, keep it low and around. I'm trying to spin Tara in place, hence the U, because I start with my hand here, swoop down and right back up in front. So it causes her to rotate 180 degrees. Yeah, and for my part, what's a little bit different about this from what we were doing before when we did the tuck turn part, we were doing rock step, kick step, kick step. This now changes my footwork because Jason's planting me on three. So instead, I end up doing rock step, step hold, but only because he's making me do that. Okay, so I'm leading that by doing rock step, step, and then putting the tail on the U. So if we did the U, the tail is the one of the tandem Charleston. Lowercase U. <laughs> Indeed.